bias that's firmly within the legal industry and the legal industry at the moment isn't meeting the latent unmet need for legal advice. The legal advice is perceived as being too expensive and lawyers are, are perceived as being unapproachable and that has to change. The difficulty is access to that expert legal advice, whether you're a small business or a individual, that's either too expensive or the recovery of costs is not certain so that if you win your case, um, uh, you know, being able to get the money back that you've expended on enforcing your rights is, is, is difficult. People can't access legal advice at the moment because the way in which legal advice is engaged is very difficult and that's something that technology is very well positioned to tackle. If you look at what the Competition Markets Authority have recently ordered when it comes to banking, they've ordered that there should be a, a, an open app so that people can use uh, different bank accounts within the same app. The way that we consume all sorts of other services from uh, web services for small businesses to enforcement of intellectual property, when you can file something online it is very natural to most of us. We can access our bank accounts even now through a mobile application. You, you can't do that if you're trying to engage legal services uh, and, and that's a huge barrier. It's, the, the lack of access to it is, is the, the lack of the beginning, the origination is a huge issue, uh, the perceived unapproachability of lawyers and, and, and of course the price and, and price certainty.